You're watching News 24 Live this weekend. Cape Town will host its second Discovery World Triathlon, which also has a very competitive para triathlete section. I'm joined in studio by para triathlete Stan Andrews, who's going to tell us about some of his achievements and, of course, this weekend's event. Stan, thanks very much for coming in this afternoon. Nick, thanks a lot for having me. So you are competing in the para tri four category. I am, in, I am indeed, sir. You asked me off air not to define what each category is exactly, but um, I mean, what other sort of competitors are you coming up against? So there, there are five categories in total, um, people ranging from absolute quadriplegics right through until two blind competitors that, wrote, that you know, compete with guides. Um, the in-between categories are guys that have limitations such as above and below knee amputations and above and below elbow amputations. So whether it be arm, whether it be leg, some of the guys have polio, there's, there's a lot of disabilities. Yeah. And, and I think the, the, the biggest thing is that it's a chance for us to showcase that no matter what the disability is, if there's a will, there's a way. Okay. So before you tell us about, about some of the events uh, you've taken part in, just give us a, a sort of short summary of your, your life story. My life story, uh, born with a deformed foot, at age C had my first prosthetic. Around about age seven, the doctor said to my folks, they suggest that they amputate the, the underdeveloped foot. Um, at that stage, no, nobody knew any better, you know, because we're talking a good couple of years ago. So the decision was made to take it, and I'm glad it was done, because I think it was probably the better decision. Growing up through school and high school, you know, try to be as normal as what I possibly could. My folks also never allowed me to use my leg as an excuse. Mm. So I was always pushed to, to do a lot of things. Um, I played soccer for 12 years, took part in some uh, tennis, action te uh, uh, table tennis. And um, yeah, after school, uh, they've dabbled into a little bit of action cricket and squash, and then also took a keen liking to golf. So I've been active, sure, but um, never really competitively as what I am now. 